Whew. So, Russia. Uh, I won this race on um, Formula Jam. So, you know, again, we know it's not a bad track for me. At this stage, it's more down to the car than me. I think I'm doing everything I can. And then I'm the Superman. Now she has regulations, yo. Been hearing whispers about the paddock that the governing body are looking to vote through regulation changes for the next year. From what we can tell, these are mainly going to affect the aerodynamic package as they want the cars better able to follow each other through the high-speed corners. So we know certain you may want to focus our upgrades on other departments. <sighs> Prince of Purge is getting a remake. I like that game. I vaguely remember watching someone play it once, and I wasn't really that interested in it. Is it just Assassin's Creed of another name? Arms are cold now, taking my jacket off. It wasn't a smart move. I care, MF. Max for stopping. Right, let's try again, shall we? Here's a comeback. We're, we're, it's a comeback. And believe in me, chat. I felt like we drive. We drove Russia pretty well last time. We're starting from under the bridge. Dude, what if I just dropped me on the middle of the fucking corner? Thanks, game. At least I know this is a balanced track, so. As possible. Best of luck out there. The time I had a perfect dive bomb. I mean, no, it wasn't a fan. Approaching the DRS zone, watch your MFD for the activation point. He was quite vocal about how much he disliked it. Dude, boob corner. Be honest, I was having a tough time there. I'm trying to figure out exactly where the gates were going to be along there. <laughs> Surprised I didn't lose it there, if I'm honest. I, I dropped back too much time, I, I felt, but I got away a bit. Okay, going well so far. I already feel like this is a better bloody uh, track for me. Slow down way too much though. Listen here, lady. Bacon? Good for me. I get the feeling, like I was gonna say, there's gonna be gates along here because I never do this well. Yeah, I, I already feel better about this track. You can just tell I feel better about it, can't you? The performance is there. Great stuff. You've pretty much nailed this. Bangarang! This is a really strong foundation to build from over the weekend. Sorry, we're not doing, we're not continuing. I just want to do a full lap. Yeah, so this corner is the weirdest one for like where it is on the track because I kind of go all over the place. I think they were asking you to slow down a bit too early there as well. Fine, that's not what I care about. Yeah, this is just a more pleasant track. I don't know why people don't like this track. And one of the um, one of the things you'll learn if you ever get into F one 
because everybody has like their favorite tracks and stuff like that and universally agreed on tracks for some reason a lot of people don't like this track and i'll never understand why i really enjoy driving it i'd rather have russia on the calendar than goddamn monaco oh the crap this is another one of a weird pit entry because you can easily like go back onto track All right, we're feeling good. That was a good start. Highly motivated, very happy. And Red Bull didn't even turn, it teleported. I think my teammate was just about to go out and I pulled in. Hello! <laughs> just had to get in your way. We're... By the Williams garage, I think. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. So we're going to get quali sim done. Then we'll get race sim done. And then we'll see what we've got left. we we'll probably knock out the other three practice things in the next session. So far, our fastest lap is a 137.2. We're about to smash that. They want us to be 11th. I don't want to presume too much. Because, you know, I'm, I, I'm only driving compared to myself. I feel like we'll end up higher than that. I think we can top three this. Okay, this is a quality sim. We've estimated the times our closest rivals will be doing, so that's what we need to beat. Maybe I have a bit too much confidence in myself, but we'll find out. See, this is the difference. Look, it's already in the green. For Singapore, I was immediately losing time from the off. I just don't think our car was good enough in Singapore. But to be fair, those two dive bombs I did. But have, like, not put it into the wall. We'd have at least left with points. Dude, we are going very wide. I don't want to, uh... Jinx it. I can see us, put I can see us putting this on pole. This Ferrari doesn't get in the way. Shock, look, look. Oh, he's running. And he runs. He runs so far away. Dude, give me that toe, daddy. Target seventh. Results first. I said it! I said it! I was feeling it! I think it's going to be a good race for us. So what I'm learning is... As long as I've got room to drive effectively my own line, I'm really good. Um, streamer, it's not becoming of a, a gentleman to brag about how good he is. Listen. I'm not good at a lot of things, so when I feel like I am good at something, I have to highlight it. I have to go, yo, check out what I'm doing. And everyone goes, Jesse just driving a F1 car in a video game. And I'm like, yeah, but I'm having a great time. That was first on balance as well. I did wonder if top speed would be the way to go here. Box this lap, please. Box this lap. We went faster in the middle. One of the bogeys on the truck is this bit here, but we seem to do okay on it, to be fair.
Well, I thought that was a like, faster purple, uh, faster middle sector, but like we're so far down in our best lap time. God, is this going to be how we race now? Like, bad race, good race, bad race, good race? When driving with the pit assist disabled, you'll need to be mindful of your speed when entering the pit lane. If you hit the limiter line too fast, you'll pick up a penalty. But it's not disabled. Why are you worried about speed it? And distance to the limiter line. Like, yo, if this thing is thingy, thingy, thingy. It's like, well, it's not relevant, because we're not thingy. So, why mention thingy? Oh, I, I forgot to tell you, chat. I uh, I booked the van as well for moving out. Virgin Media is being uh, installed almost, well, is available almost immediately. But uh, I've got an engineer coming out on Thursday. Uh, following when I move in. <laughs> so basically, I'm going to have nothing but my mobile phone uh, for internet. Which is going to suck. <laughs> but, it, you know, should be enough for me to watch Netflix on TV or something. I have to watch a Blu-ray or two. I don't want to say the nice part, because that's not really how I should describe it, but... The week I'm uh, moving into that place, I'm at my proper job for like three days of the mo of the week. And then it's Thursday. And then... Um, the internet will be installed, so... Hopefully by Friday night... Following when I move, I might be able to stream again. No guarantees, but it's what I'm hoping for right now. School is finally done. Gonna grab something to eat, then I'll be back. Oh, Kidoki! Sorry about my gross burp there in the middle. Trying to maintain a uh, murder lef level of professionalism. I meme on his burping, but like, it's scary. Yeah, my target now between when I move and oh, sorry, now and when I move is like get this season of Formula One 2020 my team done, and then get as much of a season two recorded and edited as I can. Record some monster train for the uh, YouTube channel as well. Then maybe if I have time, try and sneak in a couple of other projects. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, my teammate is uh, not slow here. So that is something I haven't done for a very long time. I did that in 2019 all the time. Just like smack that wall on the way in. Hopefully it doesn't affect too much. We have a weirdly, like, way better Delta time. Great lab. You've nailed what we asked for. Dude, you tire wear wasn't too bad, though. The speed! <laughs> How embarrassing for my teammate. If I say we're in a practice session and he can't keep up, but he's right behind me, to be fair. He ain't slow. <laughs> Spot. What? Got Pilgrim video back, boys. What does that sentence even mean? Hey, Lily, welcome back. What'd you get to eat? Tell me, but not zero, about what you're eating. Oh, I don't really know how to position the car on this uh, DRS straight. Not into the wall at the end, I know that much. Not Pilgrim vs. the World video game is back. That was a thing? I thought it was just a movie and then a comic, or the other way around. I can't make then a movie. Sounds interesting, I guess. I mean, I don't know. Super job so far. We're getting great data. Stay focused. Honestly, can't tell how good that is. 
I barely remember the movie. Was the movie good, anybody? Gibbo, you're probably a Scott Pilgrim fan. The good movie. Problem is, now I'm going to have to watch it and find out. Just some bread. You kids are eating bread. Yeah, it's a good movie. Okay. <laughs> Can I get a Gibbo movie check? I'll, uh... I'll see if it's available on a streaming service. I'll give it a, a rewatch at some point. I feel like I've heard you mention it before, or reference it before. I've seen it, I just can't remember it. Well, this is more about me than anything else. Hang on, this isn't part of the track. I got front wing damage. It's not going well for me. Scott Pilgrim is decent. Alright. Hey, I dwell in decent, so. Great lab. You've nailed what we asked for. Keep it up. Also, I'm 27, not a kid. Younger than me, you're a kid. I'm not a kid, I'm 27 and a half. Alright. Kid? Okay, Boomer. <laughs> Listen, we've already established I'm the Boomer of Twitch. And of the internet as a whole. I'm not even going to try and fight it anymore, I'm just going to play into it. Freaking Zuma. Might be a boomer, but I'm sure not a Karen. And at this stage, we all know which is worse. It's a good would you rather subject, isn't it? Would you rather be a boomer or a Karen? Boomer, probably. Nobody wants to be a Karen. But once you adopt that haircut, it's all over. Like, as dumb as it is to say, because it's obviously a generational thing, but eventually everybody will be a boomer. Not everybody has to be a Karen. And nor should you be. Oh, Latifi! Dude, I am inside him. He let me past. Kind of him. He knew he just could not compete. If I was a boomer, at least I'd have a house and an alcohol problem. Right now, I just have a problem. <laughs> no house, right? Good, good boomer joke. I said to my wife. Dude, I was doing quite well on going around that corner and doing like no damage to my tires. Not so much anymore. I just say I've got a problem. No alcohol. I absolutely have alcohol in my fridge. I'm not driving tomorrow. <laughs> oh yeah, probably should talk about that. I'm going on holiday tomorrow. That's it. That's the tweet. It's also why I'm not streaming this weekend. <laughs> going to, uh, if you're from the UK, the Peak District. That's right. There are peaks in a district. I'll get some uh, fun photos for y'all. Only have a sliver of rum. I all so I have a nice toffee apple cider. I also have the dreaded Jägermeister, which has been in my fridge for god knows how long now. And I won't throw it away because it's half a bottle of Jägermeister and that's expensive. But I also won't ever drink it because it makes me feel sick even talking about it. Okay, test complete, and that was a very good job indeed. Beautiful work, gang. What a valuable information, chat. The information money can't buy. But you can sell it to another team for profit. 
Gemo, no! You keep those cursed bottles out of here. They're, uh, shaggies, aren't they? Shaggy! There's only one lap of fuel remaining. Oh, God. I, I honestly feel a little bit nauseous just looking at those bottles. Beautiful. Yes. He's a devil, man. Really want to drink as well, but it's no straight to just, like, grab a sip. I would like to grab a sip! Come in this lap, please. Can I offer you a nice egg in this trying time? I had a little bit of a snap then. Little bit of a snap. We're okay. We're driving like a G. That's right, good driver. Grab your dick and double click for porn, porn, porn. Beautiful. Beautiful. War games. War games? In my stream? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. I want to play, guys. I want to play. Oh. And when that was relevant. Whoa, whoops. Oh, I dropped my monster condom that I used for my magnum dong. I'm out of here. <laughs> it's still funny. Uh, I should see if I can get a load of, like, always sunny downloaded somewhere. <laughs> Dude, considering I had front wing damage. We've had to spend time Look at the consistency of those lap times. How much time have we got? Two minutes? Do you reckon we got time for a, ses a session? Ah, bollocks. Best lap so far is a one minute 34. <laughs> Whoops! Ooh! Looks like I dropped my monster condom I used for my Magnum Dawn. Let's remind ourselves of our top three. Who are? Paul, Two and, and a half seconds faster the than the nearest rival. Zoom, zoom, zoom! Yeah, zoom, zoom, zoom! Remember, it's important that we finish ahead of Chuck Cluck. If we don't, we don't get two oh, no, points. Flan. We only get one. If he gets one, we is well done in it. In the famous words of Alice, Alucius Gius. Mate, we is bare done though, in it. So, let's get Urus management done. Why are we liamming me? Don't liam me! It sounds like he's behind me. Ladies and gentlemen, we're speeding. I caught it that time. So, ERS is easy. Our car is super good for this track. So we just don't use ERS. In this program, we're looking at ERS management. This is all about managing your battery efficiently throughout the lap to hit your target time. The overtake button will drain the battery quickly, but it will also Aww. give you maximum power. Maximum power! Unlimited power! And fall? It's my favorite uh, American season. Actually, my favorite American season is uh, season 13 of Friends. It's a pretty good season. Yay, Star Wars reference. You don't get many of them. Occasionally, I'll, I'll whip one out. I need to finish watching Star Wars. I, we watched, like, episode 7, or up to episode 7. I just haven't gone back to watching it yet. Unlimited power! Grab your dick and double click for porn, porn, porn. Oh, oh. It's such a good song. 
I tried going really slow then. Um, the turning at the end. I, I still almost crashed. But usually I don't use the ERS button much. Grab your dick and double click for porn, porn, porn. When I'm doing these sessions, but like that went down really well for us. Come on back! Another lightsaber for my collection. Yeah, I don't know that many Star Wars references. It's not. It's weird because I, I was really into the idea of Star Wars when I was younger. I was raised on uh, Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, Revenge of the Sith. And uh, controversial opinion. I think they're better than 4, 5, and 6. But um, I kind of was into them when I was like around 9, 10, 11. And then I just like didn't really watch them ever again. And now that I've rewatched them, I still maintain that uh, the third one, episode 3, is probably the best movie. But, uh, you know, do it. Um, but yeah, I need to watch 8 and 9. You know, a lot of people don't like them, but whatever. I feel like if you're going to start a series, unless it's terrible, you got to finish it, right? Kill him. Episode 3 so cringe. What are you on about? You learn about sand and how it's coarse and gets everywhere. You ever had a movie teach you a lesson better than that? I don't bloody think so. Kill him. Something, something, dark side. Something, something, complete. So we got, what, two more practice sessions or two more practice programs. We'll see what we can do with them. Dude, look at his lips. Fucking looking like Limmy from uh, the Limmy show. Limmy's homemade show. Somewhere Gruffle just went. Limmy reference? Don't try it! I have the high ground, Anakin! Can we not keep making me do quotes from Star Wars? What is this? Oh, we've got two more. Okay. Oh, I just said two more. Am I fucking stupid? Am I dumb? Am I just like. Duh. Why is episode 3 so cringe, Zara? Tell me all about it. Read all about it. To be honest, episode... I say episode 3 is my favourite. I think episode 1 might be. But as a 9-year-old watching that movie, I cried. Because I really liked Qui-Gon Jinn. And spoilers, they kill him. And I was like, Qui-Gon! It's up there with, like, uh, you know, the Lion King for deaths that really hit me. It's so shitly written and the acting is just cringe. But sand, it's coarse and it gets everywhere. Sorry, sir, I'm not really following your point. Sand, it's coarse and it gets everywhere. Hello? The only good part is the Mustafa jewel. There's his name is Mufasa, he's from Lion King. Hello, is the thing on? No trying to trigger me, it ain't gonna happen. You say it ain't gonna happen, I just haven't found the right thing yet. <laughs> something, something, dark side. <laughs> I am basically the Sith. I am Darth Jester. I'll be honest, if I was uh, in that universe, I would absolutely be Sith. Fuck the uh, space police. Coming straight from the underground. Star Wars ain't it, fam. Oh. What is... Out of curiosity. Oh, 
Ah, oh, we didn't quite get there. <laughs> so should I spend close to three hours tonight and finish the wild farm, or should I leave it till tomorrow? I'd leave it till tomorrow. You deserve an early night. You've worked hard. I don't know what app, but I'm sure you've worked hard. Star Wars is not that good, Immo. I mean, it's no Marvel Cinematic Universe. How many people can I make mad in one single stream? Go away, Bottas! Bottas, more like Bottas. Leave me alone! It's the memes that came from it. What, Star Wars? Listen, Tomo, I don't want to, like, disagree with you because, like, you know, you're of a different generation. But people actually like Star Wars. I know. But, like, people actually like Star Wars for Star Wars, not just because of the memes. Probably can't fall asleep again tonight, though. Went to bed at 1am last night and fell asleep around 5. Dude, F that, I'd get up and play Warcraft again. Don't tell me things. Why does somebody with a fake name want to send me a message on Instagram? Is it boobs? Send news at justtainment13 underscore on uh, Instagram. Don't, though. Hello? Oh, I'm so tired, dude. I hate to say it, but I am considering, like, stopping the stream after this race, because I, I can feel how heavy my eyes are, and I'm finding it really hard to, like, keep talking about things. I couldn't be asked to get out of bed because I wanted to try and keep my sleep schedule. Hey, you are not back on my PC at you before it is over. Why don't you love me? If you say you love me, like you say you do. If you love me half as much as I love you. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. I'm not even going to try time management. It just annoys me. If you're not feeling up to it, just it's okay if you aren't feeling good. Thank you, Tomo. I'm just tired, dude. I know I've got to get up early tomorrow because my dad's picking me up at like stupid o'clock. My dad's got an obsession. If we're, if we're holidaying in the UK, which we are, he likes to collect me at like 6, 7 o'clock. So and he's like, oh, I, just don't want, I don't want to waste the day. And I'm like, yeah, but dad, I want to sleep. I want to sleep. There's quite a buzz around this team at the moment. You should concentrate on the buzz around me. You had a bit of a rivalry going on, but it looks like they bested you. What? How? Well, thanks anyway. Shut up. How she beated me? Be how she how how she how she beaten me? Hello? I I know how I actually know if I'm tired or not because I never nap. But the fact I was like asleep before this stream watching Hell's Kitchen, I already know that I'm like yeah not feeling good. I mean, that seems bad to say. It's not I don't feel good. It's more a case of like, I could do with the sleep, you know what I mean? I know I'd, I could be performing better and right now I'm just not performing that well. I get mad if I'm not like, you know, doing a good track. I don't know how you guys feel about today's stream. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I, just, I, I don't feel like I'm putting like the amount of effort in that I could do or should do. That's just me, you know? Also, it looks like Chuckle Cluck already beat us, which is, uh, annoying. <laughs> Alright, boys, Quali, we should put it on pole. Still, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World of the Game is back. What, what do you mean, back? Is it a remake? 
I honestly had no idea there was even one in production at any point of in time. Dude, look at the Olympic Village. Dude, I'm on my iPad! For that absolute extreme gamer focus. You love to see it. Alright, boys. Wish me luck. Show up at my concentration face. <laughs> For me, I just like to make sure that I've nailed like the first part of the lap and then I can start talking again. I haven't got that in, that an embarrassing concentration face though. Like my little brother sticks his tongue out when he's concentrating. He's like this. Which I can't do because I've got a mustache. Spiky. I fall asleep. Dude, I love F1. I don't fall asleep to F1. I had, uh, had an ex who did that, though. I was like, well, excuse me, princess. Remind me next time that you're talking to just, like, fall asleep. Dude, how is this car suddenly so good again? It makes no sense. We've had, like, no new parts on it. A fantastic drive. Ladies and jelly spoons, he just keeps delivering. Half a second faster than Lewis Smuis. Amazing performance out there. I'm sure you're pretty happy with that. <sighs> yeah. Who would you say is your biggest rival at the moment? Looks like you had a great quality. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jester, what do you think of Kanye West running for president? Great. Well, that's everything. I haven't got enough laughter banked in my laughter savings account to cash out how much laughing that I have right now for that. There's something in the air. Chinese car... Carbon nanotubes or something. Are you okay? I don't even know what a nanotube is. Small tube. Yo, I watched Big Hero 6 again yesterday, by the way, chat. Um, I don't know if you were there during Murdo's stream, but he said it's not a good movie. All right. Um, call that a successful qualifying? No, chat, no, he doesn't suck. He doesn't suck. But, like, why am I friends with so many people that have bad opinions? It's just upsetting, you know? Big Hero 6 is great. Exactly. My mom was watching it. My mom doesn't watch very many movies. So I thought, you know what? I'll put Big Hero 6 on. And she loved it. Absolutely loved it. She was so hype about it. But I did have a sad realization. Um, there is a sequel in, in being made at the moment. It's Big Hero 7. The problem is, I think the seventh member of Big Hero 6 was supposed to be voiced by Stan Lee. Who obviously is no longer with us anymore. So, yeah, it's a bit of a, a bit of a shit, really. Is that appropriate, Gibbo? <laughs> Anthony Davidson, a very warm welcome to you. Yeah, I realised, you know, watching the uh, credits, and I was like, it's probably why it hasn't come out yet. There's a real shot of the title on the cards here, but one error at the wrong time, well, that could throw it all away. Of course, yep, there's never a good time to make mistakes, but it will feel ten times worse if it happens. At there's going to be a moment where we're watching Marvel movies, contest is settled where it should be, and he's he's just not in any cameo. And we're all like, look at our starting grid oof, for today's race. All lines up on pole position, and it's I get that seven reference now. Literally watched that episode a few days ago. We have that episode. Leclerc, Sebastian Vettel, and Albon. Ricardo, Sainz, Fiat, and Sergio Perez. Dude, my teammate can't even crack the top ten. Lando Norris and Gasly, Magnussen, 
Verstappen, they've taken a grid penalty. Kimi Raikkonen and Roman Grosjean. Jovanad. Dude, where's my teammate? Islands and Nicholas Latifi. Five place penalty. What did you do, Islet? Also, no big area seven due to social distancing. Listen, is it not an Umbrella Academy? No. It's a. Uh... We should be able to bring home a better result than last race. Come on, you can. Strictly come dancing. Got to remember for a minute though. Oh, look at the rockets! Come with me, and you'll be in a world of FIFA violations. I meant FIA violations, but then I realized I didn't have enough uh, syllables. Okay, this is a messy start to the lap. We definitely need to be performing better. Straight up, I am one to crack under pressure. <laughs> oh, fucking hell! What I was about to say was I could do with the Mercs dropping back a bit. Jess, what's your favourite meme ever or Vine? That's a good question. I don't know. I don't know that I've got a favourite. But, uh... Road works ahead, I sure hope it does, is a pretty big contender. I mean, most of my favourite memes are the ones that, like, are in the sounds. Or ones we made up for the stream. I sort of want to take a nap, but I sort of don't. Listen, we'll, we'll all catch up on Zoom chat. We'll all nap together on Zoom. Fuck your pillar! Roadwork ahead is great. It really is. Increasingly verbose is my favourite meme template. What's that? A loss of power? No thank you. We need absolute power! Dude, my car's suddenly, uh, not being great. I shall edumacate you. Thank you. I like learning new things. I'd never go back to school, but... Dude, the mercs are kind of catching me in, like, mid-sector. Are we losing on power? <laughs> Fuck your pillar. <laughs> ah yes, the very hunger. Fuck your pillar. The problem I've got right now is Hamilton is staying within a second of me. And we've got DRS soon. I need to do some qualifying laps. Good job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. Dude, it's like as soon as he said, we're seeing some wear on the ICU, my car was like, you know what, we're going to go a bit slower now and let the mercs catch up. Engine is showing small signs of wear. Power output will be down. Shut up! I think I might just for like, safety's sake, depending on what the next race is, take a penalty and put like a load of new parts on. I don't know. Oh, Hamilton's gonna get DRS here. And we are out of the RS. 
Great timing on that. Dude, the mercs are going to be harrying me this entire race. Can we please have a sound effect where Gordon Ramsay says raw? I mean, usually uh, sound requests are reserved for patrons. But listen, I've been watching enough Hell's Kitchen for that to make sense. Remind me on Sunday, I will look into it. This lamb is raw! You fucking donkey! Hello from Wendy! Hi, Wendy! Dude, I'm really gonna appreciate new tires. Let me tell you. I can tell I'm not using my overtake button as much anymore because, like, Hamilton's closed right up. I mean, right now, right here, right now, we need to beat Vettel. If the Mercs jump me, it's not the worst thing in the world. I'd just rather they didn't. God, the Mercs! The Mercs! They can have such a good run on me. On the start finish. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it! Run! He'll have DRS all the way up here. He's feeling brave. He could have took me there. Man, do you know what I kind of enjoy right now? The fact that just because my quality, like, single lap pace is really good, doesn't mean I'm going to kick ass in the race. I'm absolutely not kicking ass in the race. Oh, Although, I do think a lot of that is to do with the fact that my engine power has suddenly dropped. And realistically, there's not a lot we can do about that. He's coming. We just gotta survive one more lap and we get to pit. And then it's new tires. Liam. I don't know if the new tires will help, but I hope they will. He's taking names though. What, kicking ass and taking names? No, I stopped taking names. I'm not good at writing other people's names, so I used to ask them to get them to write themselves. But obviously, with social distancing, that's quite the issue. We're actually pulling away. I was not expecting that. Jester, there's a spider on my plan. Is there? Cool. Love spiders. Cats don't. But I do. Just gotta keep Hamilton behind. Well, you know, we might be able to keep him behind for this phase of the race, but, you know. We don't know how the next phase is gonna go yet. Dude, I've never been, te like, tactical with using, uh, fuel. It's, uh, it's fun. Oh, shit. Whoa! 
SWAT features. Well, it was fucking one of yes. Disgusting! Exactly! You want to pit this lab? So push now. You see the fucking cheek of him? I mean, yeah. I fucked up, but whatever. Don't ram a man. Today I'm going to be singing Cher Lloyd by Cher Lloyd. Is that a genuine song? Is 19... Is that the... Yep. yep. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, no, I think you can go faster. I'm not 100% sure on that, but... Dude, if he doesn't get me this time round. You've, you've got to respect the hustle. You really do. Fair fucking play. That was a really good dive. That's the first time I've seen the AI actually do well. I drive well, in my opinion. Uh, Jester, do you have a favourite song? Uh, I do. Right now. I don't have an overall favourite, probably. Um, at the moment, one of my favourite songs is, um... Ah! Oh, Sober Up by AJR. The car is just slow there. It's not slow. I'm just not getting to that speed. Um, what's Hello from Wendy even from? You should ask Aria. Aria knows. Add request sound effect to reward points that redeemed. That's a good Should call, actually, Gebo. I might do that. As a wise man once said, I like it. I was the only car to pit. Which means we probably got some overtaking to do. Speaking of point, don't do cat cam. Please don't do cat cam. God damn it. Oh, now I'm going to go find one of them. I can't do cat cam right now. I'm driving. I'll find one in a second. Hold your Rahi. Oh no, some people pitted. Latifi and Stroll pitted. So right now, what we want to do is not lose time behind slower drivers like Russell. Unfortunately, it appears that we don't have a lot of choice. We have five laps of fuel remaining. Perfect, that's enough for the, me to get the job done. Callum in the pits. Callum in the pits. One of the mercs is pitted. We've got to get out ahead of them. We have. Excellent. Itchy nose. Bottas. Okay, so Hamilton is still out there. He could leapfrog me in the pits. Which is disrespectful. But it is the car behind has boxed for the mediums. not unlikely with how close Bottas is. We're basically asking the AI to have a few shit laps, and I don't think that's going to happen. We had Neo yesterday in the cat can, didn't we? I'll see you and find Sylvie. Won't you help me sober up? I really was hoping I was close enough to use DRS. 
just to get a bit of a speed boost. Unfortunately, that was not meant to be. Ah, I've done a little bit of damage to my front wing as well. I'm annoyed because this is a race for us to win. Wonderwolf boss guard. Okay, I'm sure I'll forget that for you. Gap to car in front is 2.2 seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, we're out ahead of them. Bottas might get him. We actually, we actually increased our lead. Awesome. So, as long as we keep the gap above a second, Hamilton won't get DRS and he won't be able to close the gap. And based on how we were performing before the pits, I think we'll be okay. And a dab too? Jesus Christ. What do you people want so much from me? There's three laps of fuel remaining. We're increasing the gap, which is huge. I'm so happy. Honestly, at the pace that the Mercedes were having, I was like, yeah, they're absolutely going to jump me in the pits. Fortunately, not the case. Although, they're making up time on me. Got to keep you away. Oh my god, you want me to do all of this before the end of the stream? Dumb thing is, you're expecting me to remember to do all this. Does cat cam make me dab? Joke and a laugh track. I'm keeping tabs. Yeah, but boss god, like, you know, you're not a mod, so I can't trust you. Now, if Gibbo was keeping tabs, you know, I'd have someone to trust, but... I was about to say, do you reckon I can get faster slap? I already have it. I'd also like to keep it secure. That's weird, really, isn't it? Because, like, the Mercedes have been catching up to me on most laps. Yet they haven't had a faster slap yet. How weird. And make me one. No. Some information on Stroll. It looks like the problem is terminal. They're retiring the car. The shot isn't big enough for me to need any more mods. I love the fact that we're actually talking about mods again. I don't, when was the last time we talked about mods? They don't trust me either. Rude. Lily, I've known you for like two weeks, alright? You know what? Let's try and save ERS. I don't know if we've got enough fuel mix. I kind of want to go for a fastest lap, but... I don't know what will happen if I don't go for a fastest lap. Yellow flag. The freaking Mercs will steal it off me. Again. Green flag. Do you trust me? No. I trust my mods and that is it. I don't take it personally, I don't so trust anybody. I've had my trust broken far too many times to be making uh, trust of uh, strangers on the internet. All my mods are my mods and I've met them in real life. I know they're real people I can trust and not Russian bots. Like I suspect a lot of you are.
Cat Cam, Wonder Wall, Boscar, Dabbing, Joke, and Laugh Track. Do you want me to tell the joke while dabbing? I don't think we're going to go for that faster slap, by the way. I don't dare risk the fuel. Laugh track out of Wonder Wall. Thirty point nine seconds. As slow as he. Also, uh, Bottas got ahead of Hamilton. You're making Google Translate say shit. <laughs> AI said shit. <laughs> Dude, Leclerc overtook Hamilton. Oh no! The fight's out! I'm about to punch your lights out! Okay, a bit wide, that's fine. It's not fine actually. Bottas is a rocket right now. How is Bottas so quick all of a sudden? I bet he's going fast as lap. I bet that prick is going for the fastest lap. We advise moving to mix two, fuel to mix two. Oh, fuck off, dude. I just clipped the corner. I hope I slowed him down enough to not let him steal fast slap. Oh, fuck! Woo! Bottas got some Zorna Lemke at the pits and now he's coming at you like a mustard cover jam. <laughs> what? A mustard colored covered jet engine. So after a day of mixed fortunes up and down the field, we bring today's race to a close. Anthony, tell me, what was it that helped them achieve the success? Mr. Crowley! Dun, dun, dun! I know it sounds like an obvious thing to say, Crofty, but fast cars win races. How do you get those buttons to switch classes in FF14? Uh, it's using gear gear sets. But I'm sure it's nothing compared to our drivers here. They've worked hard to make it up there, and it's great to see them. Make them oh, we won, didn't we? <laughs> Uh, he wanted a laugh track and uh, joke, or joke and laugh track. Chat, why is a pencil the heaviest thing in your school bag? Because it's made of lead. Let's have a look then at the driver's standards. <laughs> Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your driver? But I saw my fastest lap again. Commanding performance, and I think had the Rick! guys glued to him for the majority. Fuck! Why do the mercs keep stealing my stuff? Let's have yours. Shut up, slag. What do you think made the difference between this weekend and last weekend? We all underestimated you, didn't we? Uh, you, you did, but everyone's allowed one mistake. <laughs> Appreciate your time. Get put in your place, you licorice haired bitch. Look at that. How did he go faster than me? Seb Vettel. Get out of here. Get out of town. Listen, don't you keep goddamn wonder walling when I just did one. You kids are the worst. I just want to go to bed. Yo, so it's the Japanese Grand Prix next for both F Jam and uh, my team runs. Cool. Cool. Um, oh, to answer your question, by the way, Boss God, uh, we will be doing F Jam this weekend. I, sh I should be home in time for that. All right, ladies and jelly spoons. Thank you very much for watching. As always, here is an outro. And while there is an outro, I'm going to go get a cat. Be right back. In the room? I'll be way too convenient.
Here is Sylvie. She is not happy about being awake. She is so pissed off. She hates this. <laughs> What's up, sweetie? Sylvie. She hates me. <laughs> there you go, sweetie. She's a good girl, really. Um, Raid Beard Ashmore. Dude, I can do that. I like Ashmore. Maybe dab. Whoppa! Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. As always, once again, sorry I'm quitting the stream a little early today. Um, but I'm tired, dude. I've got to be up early in the morning and I got this list of excuses. I can keep going. Dab again. Why not? Uh twitch.tv forward slash jestertainment is what I am to see the VODs vlogs and other videos at youtube.com forward slash jester on demand. Demand. Demand to see what I'm ranting about this week, twitter.com forward slash jestertainment underscore, and to see the Discord, it's bit.ly slash jester Discord. I'm trying to type and talk at the same time, I'm really sorry. If you want to support the channel, if you're watching and following, you're doing a great job, and thank you so much for doing so. If you want to do more than that, though, you can, of course, go to patreon.com forward slash jestertainment, just like my wonderful Patreon producers who are Binglepin, who's available at twitch.tv forward slash Binglepin, and twitter.com forward slash Binglepin. Jester on the man, that's it. Uh, Murdo, who's available at twitch.tv forward slash Murdo and twitter.com forward slash Murdo, he wrote. Uh, Aria Lankawai, who's available at instagram.com forward slash Aria Winning Sun and instagram.com forward slash Princess Music, that's right, the I is a V. And Heckin Small B, who's available at instagram.com forward slash Mystical Woosh. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to go raid Beard Ashmore, so don't forget to do a good old Jester raid in chat. Um, but until Sunday, guys, thank you very much for watching. Uh, check Murdo out on Friday at 7 pm. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great weekend. See ya. And boop. Oh, shit, wrong button. I keep pressing the wrong button.